Hi everyone, I'm Leila. I grew up in Los Angeles in a home in which Persian language is spoken. And now I'm going to Iran to visit my family and friends and figure out what being Iranian means to me. World opens up when you're in a place like Iran. The good thing is that you're never alone in Iran. Come along on my journey to practice speaking Persian with short conversations, discover Persian culture, see the beauty of Iran as one of the world's oldest civilizations, and visit the kindest, most humble and hospitable humans who reside on this planet. Let's jump into all that in just a second. I just want to let you know that every week I make fun lessons like this one so you can understand fast speaking Persians and learn to speak like a native. So if you wanted to, all you have to do is to hit that subscribe button and the bell down below so you don't miss any of the new lessons. First, listen to the conversation and try to understand. Next, repeat the vocabulary and write them down and use them in a conversation or a paragraph. And finally, complete online activities on Talk Like a Persian website and download the ebook. Let's get us started. سلام، صبح بخیر سلام، صبح بخیر عصر بخیر عصر بخیر چطورید؟ خوبم، متشکرم سلام صبح بخیر ظهر بخیر عصر بخیر چطورید؟ خوبم Writing from right to left the basic word order in Persian is subject, predicate, verb The verb is always placed at the end of the sentence in Persian, verb endings mark the person, the number and the tense. Therefore, a verb may be considered as a complete sentence or a clause by itself and does not need a subject at all times. Look at these examples. Man leila hastam. In this sentence, man is the subject. In the second one, there is no subject. Because when you look at verb to be, it shows the person, the number, and the tense. Leila hastam.